hey guys today we'll see how can we install live coding in pycharm we'll see how can we download pycharm so open your browser and type pycharm download click on community version because it's free and open source and download okay once you have downloaded the file uh, install it next next just click all the options okay no problem taking all the options in there like it'll add a shortcuts on your desktop and it'll create a pycharm path in the environment variables and all the stuff so it's better if we do everything okay once it's done just give finish we can manually report it later if we want and now open pycharm Uh, let it be to not import settings. Okay. Now select uh, whichever the UI you want. Uh, I'll select light because I'm presenting the screen. Start using by charm. Okay, hit create a new project and give some name like anything untitled one two whatever you want. As you can see, the base interpreter is already selected. So that because we have already installed Python and now hit next so it's setting up a virtual environment now close this tip of the day we don't need it now okay once that completes uh, open it and you'll get a warning from windows defender just configure it automatically and now create a file new and python file and uh, give a name like uh, hey now we'll install the live coding plugin to install live coding plugin go to file and settings plugins and here type live coding so we need to install this accept so once you have installed it see this is also developed by the same guy that is don he developed this uh, live coding module for even eclipse and also the pycharm so thanks to him and apply and okay once that is done you may have to restart your pycharm once exit and open it again so once you restart you can see the live coding options have enabled so if it is still not enabled then you can just try like this type of program and just run it then start the live coding b is equal to 20 and c is equal to a star b and print c so now we can start the live coding by here and also here Okay, here you can see the live coding is working so that is how you set up live coding in your pc and uh, with that being said adios amigo